Welcome to LaunchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today I want to use a small security story as an excuse to talk about a bigger security problem, and that's malicious or dangerous documents. Today a HelpNet security article pointed out the increase in Office macro-based malware. You probably heard of Office macros, the, the code or script that you can add to an Office document to do automated tasks. For the longest time, bad guys have leveraged macros to do bad things, to ultimately install malware on your computer. In fact, this sort of evil macro technique is over a decade old. The HelpNet security article pointed out research from Trend Micro and even earlier research from Microsoft that shows macro-based malware is making a comeback. And that's interesting in itself, but the real point of this video is to warn you that documents can be dangerous. Macros are just one of the ways bad guys can leverage documents to install malware. You know, the software we use, like Word and Adobe Reader, to read documents can suffer from security uh, vulnerabilities. On top of that, today's document isn't just a document, it's a multimedia file that can have tons of embedded content, whether it be a link or flash content or video content or whatever. And thus, a document has a huge attack surface that can give a bad guy access to vulnerabilities in other software as well. The point is, just opening a document can result in malware silently installing on your computer. Now, I I suspect a lot of your users realize that executable files can be dangerous. If you get an unsolicited email with an executable file, you might want to avoid it. However, I think many users think that documents are benign or inert and can't hurt them. And as a result, advanced sophisticated attackers have been using documents a lot more in spear phishing email because they realize that users are more apt to click on that particular content. Now, as a security professional, I'm sure that you already knew that documents can be dangerous. But again, I suspect many of the folks at your organization don't know this. So take this as an opportunity to remind users to be careful with documents. Getting unsolicited documents contains some risk. So make sure your users are very skeptical when they're opening documents from folks that they don't know. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.